The Fountain Day One, The In-Between. I'm feeling the Spirit move deeper in me every day, and as I learn more about God and His ways, I have become more willing to allow for the in-between time, because that time strengthens my character and makes me unbreakable. Until the time came to fulfill his dreams, the Lord tested Joseph's character. Psalm 105, verse 19. Consider it pure joy, my brothers and sisters, whenever you face trials of many kinds, because you know that the testing of your faith produces perseverance. Let perseverance finish its work so that you may be mature and complete, not lacking anything. James 1, verses 1 through 4. I am forged in the fire. As the flames of disappointment flare up around me and my heart moans in discomfort, I am held. I become refocused on the giver of the promise. I become further enamored with his presence. It's all about him. It always has been. It's us that sometimes forget. He is worthy of it all. The lamb that was slain and rose again as the lion of Judah. He roars over us, stirring our passions and igniting our very souls. He is, he will be, he is yet to come. All glory, honor, and power is his forever. So why would we fear tomorrow? Why fear any weapon formed against me? His power shaped the world. His breath is in every lung. His wonders never cease, and I belong to him. That's enough for me. Don't worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow will worry about itself. Each day has enough trouble of its own. Matthew 6, verse 34. Don't brag about tomorrow since you don't know what the day will bring. Proverbs 27, verse 1. We are called to live with a spirit of humility, not worrying about and not bragging about tomorrow. A beautiful balance of living content with this day. I have let go of the more of the world and embraced the more found in the simple. Making space for your voice, making room for change, being more aware of your spirit. You make wise the simple. Bring wisdom into my simplicity. Bring fullness into it. Make full use of the space created when I step away from the busyness of the world and linger in the simple. Come rest on me today, Lord. The law of the Lord is perfect, refreshing the soul. The statutes of the Lord are trustworthy, making wise the simple. Psalm 19, verse 7. Today, I encourage you to take a moment and breathe. Stop in the midst of your daily tasks and simply be. Be still and know fully that he is God. Thank him for this day. Breathe again and let go of any worry you have in your heart. Will you give him today and let him make of it what he will? He is capable. He says, be still and know that I am God. I will be exalted among the nations. I will be exalted in the earth. Psalm 46, verse 10.